Today, we are going to be making slime, or silly putty, without borax. Here's what you'll need. Some Elmer's white glue, liquid starch, which can be found in the detergent aisle, food coloring, and something to stir with. We're going to be mixing our glue and liquid starch in the two to one ratio. First, take two tablespoons of white glue and put it into a dish. Next, put six drops of food coloring of your choice into your glue and stir well. We're using popsicle sticks, but you can use a spoon. Next, add one tablespoon of liquid starch into your glue and stir immediately. You'll see it start to harden. Now take it out of your dish and knead it with your hands, then put it on wax paper for at least half an hour. The longer you wait, the more it will turn out like silly putty. While I'm waiting for my silly putty, I thought I'd share a letter with you that I got in the mail. It says, Dear WizKid, my name is Miles. I am five and a half and I live in San Jose. I like watching you and making science experiments. I like you making goop. What is your favorite science project? <clears throat> and then this is a picture he drew of the slime and the slime is actually my favorite science project. You can send me mail at the address listed in the description below. Here's our finished slime or silly putty. You can bounce it, make it into shape, stretch it. You can even lift a print off a newspaper. Take a newspaper and put it on a comic picture. Then flatten it and then slowly take it off. making your own silly putty. Try some different colors. Thanks, Thanks for watching!